So now we're going to listen to the space heater on some clean guitar. So uh, again, I'm just using the space heater as a hardware insert. This time we're using channels five and six, and I've got a stereo stem of the uh, uh, clean guitar in this song. So start playback here. All right, so here's the dry guitar. Space heater bypassed. Space heater engaged. We're just hearing the transformers right now. So levels at about three o'clock on both channels. In, bypassed. So bring it back in, and now we'll turn on the tube drive. So you can see our drives are set at about the 10 o'clock position, levels at about the three o'clock position. Now I'll bring up the drives on both channels to about 12 o'clock. level a little bit. So we've got the drive at about 12, the level at about 1, bypassed, engaged. Now we'll bring up the drive to about 3 o'clock on both channels. back to about the 12 o'clock position, levels up to about one. Hundred and forty volts. Down to seventy. Down to thirty-five. So bring the levels right back up to compensate there. So there's the thirty-five. Drives at about 12 o'clock and levels are at full blast. Bring the drives up to about the 3 o'clock position. Bypassed. And we'll increase the heat. So that was the space heater on a clean guitar. As you can see, you can really just apply a bunch of distortion, make that clean sound like it's coming through a tube amp, uh, or just uh, warm things up a little bit.